Wagner boss starts an armed struggle in Africa this time. The Wagner private military company is continuing to recruit and is working hard to make Russia even greater, the head of the group Yevgeny Prigozhin has said in a new video address. He added that Wagner is also seeking to help Africa become even more free. The short video emerged online and was apparently filmed in Africa. The private military company boss was armed and dressed in military garb while standing in a savannah like landscape with multiple armed men and gun trucks visible in the background. The Wagner Group conducts reconnaissance and search activities, making Russia even greater on all continents, and Africa even more, justice and happiness for all the African people. Prigozhin stated, adding that the group has been pursuing ISIS, Al-Qaeda and other bandits. Wagner is hiring real heroes, the private military company boss said, claiming that it continues to fulfill the tasks that were set and to which we made a promise that we could handle. Prigozhin did not elaborate on the specific nature of those tasks or the people who had set them. It was also not immediately clear exactly when or where the address had been recorded. The address came after around two months of silence from the Wagner chief. Prigozhin had been active on social media prior to the botched insurrection launched by the private military company in late June amid a dispute with the Russian Defense Ministry. The private military company ended up being redeployed to Russia's closest ally, Belarus, under a deal facilitated by President Alexander Lukashenko. Over the past few weeks, Poland has repeatedly sounded the alarm over Wagner's presence in Belarus, even claiming that its contractors tried to breach the border. Minsk has firmly rejected the allegations of Wagner's purported activities, with Lukashenko claiming Warsaw had gone mad with all the speculation surrounding the private military company.